Paris. He was. You should, yeah, right? good for Spencer. Covering Colorado first now in Adams County. New information to a story we've been covering for more than two years. The Adams County 14 School District has now settled a years long dispute with its former private management company, MGT Consulting. Yeah, now originally, MGT Consulting was hired to run Adams 14 after years of low test scores. Our investigator, Katie Weiss, is the only reporter who obtained the settlement agreement that some say is really vindicating Adams 14. Yeah, it absolutely is. What what some people think yeah. might be a vindication. This agreement shows MGT is now required to pay Adams 14 $1.5 million. Mm. It was just signed this week after years of fighting between those two entities. The state school board required Adams 14 to work with a private management firm back in 2018 due to consistently poor student performance. The district hired MGT but fired the consultant after four years, claiming the company mismanaged tax dollar funds and didn't help students improve. MGT refuted that, saying it helped increase graduation rates and lower dropout rates. Because Adams 14 fired MGT, the district is now facing possible dissolution or reorganization from the state. The state would not say how this settlement might affect future decisions on dissolution because the settlement is a matter between Adams 14 and MGT. Now, the $1.5 million settlement will be split two ways, $1 million to the school district and 500,000 to be donated to the Adams 14 Education Foundation. And you know, guys, because this agreement has this NDA clause, Adams 14 and MGT really can't comment any further on this. Katie, we do know the State Teachers Union really standing up for Adams 14 today. Yes, they are. The Colorado Education Association says that this decision really reinforces what they already knew, that a private for-profit company was never meant to answer Adams 14's problems. They, the CEA also says that it hopes that this costly experience is a lesson learned for education agencies across the state. Yeah, let's hope so. Katie, thank you so much for staying on top of that for us. For sure.